Okay, this is a pretty simple drill you can do pretty much anywhere that's gonna show you a lot about how much mobility you have in your upper body rotation. It's super easy, just get in what feels like a pretty good posture, seated on, seated on any seat that doesn't have arms that are gonna block you. And that means like right now I'm scooted up on the front of this seat, I feel like I'm in a good posture. Put your hands out in front of you so your elbows are just in front of your rib cage, kind of like where they might be in your golf setup and hands together kind of facing forward. So now I've got my hands directly in front of my sternum. From there, I'm just gonna rotate my upper body, my head, so my neck, my head, my chest, and my hands. I want them all to move together, kind of not as far as I can go, but just get a real feeling for how kind of little you can rotate that upper body when your lower body is stabilized. So you'll do one where you get, make sure that we see our hands directly in front of our sternum, eyes looking at the hand so that the head rotates with. Rotate, feel how far you can kind of go. Come back to the middle, relax. Get a comfortable posture again, and then rotate again the other direction. Trying to keep those hands in front of the sternum and the eyes looking at the hands. Come back to here, relax again. Kind of shake out the tension, start again. I think if you do this four or five times, it's like a 10 second drill each time. I think it's great if you could do it four or five times. But even just once or twice, just feeling it, you know, kind of randomly throughout the day, feeling your body stretch, it's a really interesting one to just kind of be aware more of what your, what your body's able to do and, and not able to do. And if you do it often, you'll find that it starts getting easier and easier to make a little bit more of an upper body rotation without having this so much restriction. And you'll feel it, I can feel it in the middle of my back, kind of like just a whole, across my whole upper torso, everything just feels kind of tight and restricted. So again, the keys are elbows in front, hands together directly in front of the sternum, eyes and nose and head and everything lined up with the hands, and we move all of this together, and it's working across or against a stabilized lower body. That's why we're doing it while seated.